what is up you guys and welcome back to my channel so i will be creating this cute sultry classy look for you so if you want to know how i achieved it keep on watching so first things first is the primer so this is the maybelline baby skin primer and i like to just have that sit on my face before i do anything else so then I'll be going in with the brows and you can see the tail end of my brows are quite sparse and this is where I like to fill them in a little bit and then go in with my highlight. Take another sip and dance a little bit before I do a nice outline of my brows and just clean up anything that isn't meant to be there and just take my time with this process as I always like to do. If I'm in a rush, I will not even touch my brows because I don't like to rush and do my makeup. If I don't have the time for it, then I'm not going to be wearing anything. So you can just see me outlining my brows here. And I think for this look, I kept the tail in quite long. And that's brows done. So next, I'm going to start off by doing the eye makeup first. So I'm just going to start with a clean base and use the 17 Cosmetics Concealer in the shade 002. Just so all the eyeshadow can be evenly distributed on my eyes. So I really like this palette from Makeup Revolution and the colors don't have names, but you can see that I'm just gonna go in with this black shade here. It's not too pigmented. I didn't, I didn't pick up so much on the brush. Next, I'll be going in with the, it's like a nice burgundy, more like a burnt red, burnt orange shade. Kind of the same shade as my top. And I'm just going to put this on my lids as well and just blend that out nicely. I like to go in with a nice wing. I would say a subtle wing, but this is kind of a big wing, which I always like to execute. And I'll be going in with the e.l.f. liquid liner. I've been using this for years. I stand by e.l.f. especially when it comes to their products and most certainly this eyeliner. So before I go in with any lashes, you want to have a nice mascara on. And then I'm just putting on this Maybelline Sky High Mascara and eyes are done for now. I'm going in with the same concealer that I use for the lid and just gonna kind of do a reverse makeup on the face. So start with the highlight and contour, then go in with the foundation. So I'm just highlighting the high points of my face and going in with the Revolution Stick Tint in the shade Dark for contour. Blending can be very tedious but as long as you have a damp beauty blender and you just take your time just make sure everything is blended out really nicely. It looks like I'm hitting my face really hard, but I promise you I'm not. So now I can go in with my Fit Me foundation in the shade 356 in Warm Coconut. 
um i've noticed over time my foundation shades have been changing due to the weather um there's not much sun here in england um but over time my makeup shades have been changing i'm not sure if any of you guys have noticed that as well My hair is actually so cute like this. I actually took some pictures and put my hair up. And I wish I had my hair up in this video. It would have just gave a different vibe. But overall, I think this hair is just so cute and simple. So I'm just going to go with a little bit more concealer. I think I kind of lost a little bit of the highlight under the eyes due to the foundation. But just a little bit goes a long way as you can see. I really like Seventeen Cosmetics. Um, I only discovered them about a few months back. And their stuff is super affordable as well. So now I'm just going in with the same setting powder that I used on my lids, which is the Laura Mercier powder and honey usually i would go in with the laura mercier translucent powder but i wanted a little bit of a shade to the powder So after that has sat on my face for a little bit, I just like to brush the excess off and then go in with the same shade that I used on my lid, just on my under eye, my waterline here. And then I don't know if people still do this, but adding a nice subtle shimmer on the inner corners of my eye. I don't know if people still do that, but... I think it's super cute. Then I just go with some nice contour. Look at that. Look at that. She's giving. She's giving. So you guys know I swear by this in all of my videos. I use this bronzer, which is in medium deep. I'm obsessed with it. Um, I think they'll probably discontinued it, but I love it. <laughs> Now for the lips, I'm just going to go in with the Rimmel London shade, and this is in Stable Brown. And just outline my lips with this. And now for this nude lipstick, it's so cute. Um, I was gonna go in with my usual gloss, but I figured let's try something different as I always use a gloss in my videos. But then I just went in with the Technique, I think it was the High Shine lip gloss. And all that hard work just to look beautiful. Absolutely stunning. And there she is looking cute with a nice smile. Look at me, <laughs> pretty. So that's it, you guys, for this look. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.